name is Shrini and I'm a breathwork facilitator. People come to me for all different reasons. A majority of them have been feeling that something is not right. They know that they need to work on themselves, but they don't really know how to do that. So what I do is I provide them with a tool and I teach them how to feel into the body, how to feel the emotions. And then once you feel them, how we can work through them. I grew up in Texas in a conservative suburb of Dallas. My parents were from India, so I was a first generation American. This kind of shaped my experience and my identity as this very confused person. I spent three months each year in India and the rest of the year in the US. I never felt fully connected or accepted in either place. This just led to a lot of disconnect with myself and a lack of confidence, ultimately just um, a lot of negative emotions. I actually discovered Buffett by accident. From that first session, it just changed my life. I was able to really work on my relationship with myself and heal these parts of me that were very deep inside of me. I was able to do this self-healing, I thought, I have to share this with other people. So in a typical breathwork session, what you will experience is first just a sense of grounding. If it's a group class, we really like to build a sense of community and make sure the space is safe. From there, we take a moment to set an intention for the work. And then move into a meditation and learn how to feel emotions in the body. And then from there, we start the breathing. So typically, there can be a lot of emotions as well as resistance from negative emotions. Fear, anger, frustration, shame, guilt. And then the other side, experiencing happiness, bliss, freedom, surrender, and altered states of consciousness, feeling a sense of ecstasy. Often people will just intuitively want to shake their body to release trauma, bang on the floor, curl up into a ball, open up. And a lot of tears, anything is possible, and anything is welcome. Afterwards, there's some time to just go inward, write, or make art about your experience, and then regroup with the whole group to build a sense of community share your experience, make sure that you can leave feeling safe and grounded. Um, that was completely unexpected. Uh, my body, mind, soul, my soul. Right now I just feel amazing. I feel this fantastic sense of self-love and self-compassion, which is um, sometimes a little bit more difficult for me to feel for myself. Eventually you just let go and you just realize how much love you have in you. Yeah. Having my body seize up like that and being able to power through it mentally, um, it really kind of brought me to peace and then the overall gratitude for just, for this experience. Often we are not given the chance or told that it's not okay to feel shame or feel fear or guilt. And some people even feel guilty about joy. So really, the major benefit is to uncover these emotions inside of us and then learn how to navigate them and learn how to express them.